Hello there, this is Nope Name. Finally, I can present to you the first full version of my MC64, which is a virtual computer inside Minecraft. And if I right click now, the screen will appear and this um, user interface here that allows me to program the computer. If you want to try it out for yourself, there's a download link in the description. It also include, in, includes, sorry, it includes a full documentation on the programming language here. And yeah, you can try it out for yourself. Um, the map will al already um, contain this program that I'm going to show you in this video. So you have an example for a program. And yeah, um, this example here contains the snake game from a previous video, but also um, a pong game, which I will demonstrate right now. And if you start the program, you can first select the game. Um, one is for Pong and two is for the snake game. And if you enter any other value, it will just ask you again. So let's select one for the Pong game. And if I use uh, the up and down key, um, you can see that that black line on the left of the screen uh, moves up and down. And using that, I can control the uh, ball flying across the screen. And yeah, you have to prevent the ball from hitting the left wall of the screen. Because if that happens, you lose. And that's already it. <laughs> um, it's quite simple. Um, let's try it again. There are a few bugs in there, especially when you hit um, the edge of that, what do you even call that, of that line you're controlling, when it might um, glitch out sometimes. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> um, yeah, as you can see, it runs quite smooth and yeah, it doesn't create a lot of lag, at least on my computer. Um, if your computer is quite slow, it might not run at all. Also make sure to allocate at least um, 5 gigabyte of RAM to Minecraft, otherwise the game will freeze and eventually crash. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, I didn't miss that one. Um, yeah, if you want to stop a program, press Q to throw an item. Um, so let's select the snake game now. If you have seen my previous video, you already know it. It's quite simple. If you eat those red dots, the snake will get longer. And if you hit a wall or the snake itself, you will lose. It's quite simple. As you can see, the screen is uh, smaller for this game. It could be bigger, but just... Um, for that experiment, I decided to make a small screen. Um, yeah, so you can download it. As I said, it will contain these two games already, but you can reprogram it. And make sure to read the documentation and to allocate enough RAM to Minecraft. This is an extremely resource intensive <laughs> project. <laughs> the data pack, it mainly consists of um, is 90 megabytes big and it has it contains about 40,000 um, function files and yes I am crazy anyways I hope you are having fun with it and I hope some of you can come up with some cool programs and yeah I will update the project in the future to add more features and to fix some bugs and so on. And that's it for this video. See you next time. Bye.